tag bad columns. Again, something completely different, completely different application. Pack beds are used in filtration. They are used in reactions. For example, if you have a catalytic bed, one good example is uh, oligonucleotides, which are very big, uh, like uh, protein-like molecules, which you synthesize on a polymeric substrate. But then you have pack beds for filtration, all kinds of pack beds. Well, typically, if you have a packed bed, you have your packing, which is this inner cylinder. You have a certain column, which is the outer big cylinder, and you have an entrance and an exit. Of course, systems can look a bit different, huh? but generally, conceptually, it comes down to this. Uh, in this case, we have been modeling uh, a packed bed with a polymer packing that is actually susceptible to the kind of solvent you put on it. So if you change a solvent on a polymer, the polymer, polymer can actually start shrinking or expanding. So that can happen. If it does that, of course, your porosity of your bat, also your resistance of your bat, and finally your pressure drop over your bat, and also your dynamics, flow dynamics through your bat, it will all change. So just to illustrate this a bit, we have done this TFD simulation. Um, where we where you will see the bed expanding. Again, I will not go into these numbers too much, but we have been testing different fluids. I mean, change the viscosity, change the density, and we even did a scenario where one fluid has to remove the other one, how they mix. We have changed flow rates. We have played with the resistance. For example, how fine is your packing material? We have changed the height and the diameter as well. So different scenarios, don't pay too much attention to which scenario is what. I will come back to that. So what you will be seeing here is a, a lot of information again. These are just six from these seven scenarios. Um, you can see the big diameter in the middle. And then the other ones have the same diameter. But for example, it can be an other solvent. Or the flow rate can be changed. It can be two solvents. It can be a low resistance or high resistance. So just let's play everything first and then analyze. So this is how things happen here. You see the color indicates the incoming solution. So it doesn't mean that there is not a solution in the beginning. Eh? So the column was initially filled with either the same solvent or another one, another one in scenario seven, the same one in the other ones. So it's not that if you don't see anything, for example, a transparent color, that there is not anything happening. The color is the new solvent we add from the start. So let's play everything again. It's a lot of information. Uh, first conclusion, behavior across these systems is quite different, right? Of course, look at the high resistance ver versus low resistance. In the high resistance, you get much more plug flow behavior. It's kind of a rainbow pattern. While in the low resistance case, your solvent can actually shoot through the bat more or less. And it can be exiting already before your initial uh, liquid volume was removed. So here, your entering liquid will actually start removing your existing liquid. Let's call it that way. And here, you can actually have a mixture. And it can take a while. Here, you have 100% incoming solvents in this case. Of course, if you have a large diameter and apply the same flow rate, it takes much longer. And combined with a high resistance, yeah, it gives a, a completely different result. I don't think it makes sense to go over each of those simulations in detail. Uh, but what I, well, maybe one point I should mention is just pay attention to the expanding uh, polymer bed. So you see it expanding and shrinking, um, which we have included in the simulation, depending on what you put in it. Of course, these synthesis reactions, in this case, this is a synthesis reaction. They can take a few hours. Huh? Uh, we are just summarizing everything here in a simulation of a few seconds. So it's a lot of uh, information here. OK, so this, this is packed bad columns, uh, just to illustrate that you can uh, also play with such kind of systems. <laughs> 